Hey there and welcome back. So Tesla recalls nearly 500,000 vehicles over safety issues. That's right, over 356 Model 3 2017 to 2020 vehicles as well as another 119,000 Model S sedans between 2014 and 2021 are affected by this recall. It states Tesla has recalled nearly 500,000 vehicles to address safety issues related to malfunctioning rear view cameras and misaligned hood latches that could increase the risk of accidents. So get this, it states the Model 3 vehicle Vehicles have a damaged rear view camera cable due to repeated opening and closing of their trunk lids. Uh, the issue could prevent the rear view camera from image from displaying according to NHTSA. That is absolutely ridiculous. You figured they would design it so you can open and close your trunk all the time and it wouldn't damage the cable. And also if you're backing up, you shouldn't be relying on your rear view camera. You should also be shoulder checking and checking anyways and not just rely on the camera because there is blind spots. This is crazy. It also states the impacted Model S vehicles may have a misaligned front hood latches which officials said could prevent the hood from properly closing and cause it to open unexpectedly obstructing the driver's view increasing the risk of a crash teslas be driving around with their hoods flipping up like that oh my lord that'd be insane and crazy and scary like i couldn't even imagine how like driving and then the hood just pops open like that most people like their reaction is just going to freak out they're going to slam on their brakes i'm surprised nobody's been in a serious accident so far it's on to state that the Shares initially fell 3% in trading, but recovered and were flat as midday, so they didn't even really get impacted. Uh, respect to Tesla because it says that they were not aware of any crashes, injuries, or deaths stemming from either issue, but the company plans to fix the defects for free, which is awesome because nobody's been hurt or injured, as well as that they're going to uh, fix the uh, defects for free, which you would assume they would and not charge the consumer. There's three other issues with the Teslas, which are kind of crazy. It states the vehicle recall would unfold it amid mounting federal scrutiny on Tesla vehicles. Tesla recently agreed to block access to in-vehicle video games while cars were in motion following pressure from safety officials. So you can literally drive a Tesla or have it on autonomous mode and play video games. That, that's just mind-blowing. They should have blocked that since day one. So goes on to state in October, Tesla officials to explain why they didn't issue a recall when they implemented an earlier software update to correct a safety related issue with the company's autopilot semi-autonomous driving system. As well, in August, the NHTSA opened a formal probe into Tesla's autopilot functioning, examining 12 crashes where the Tesla vehicles using autopilot may have failed to detect emergency vehicles. That is insane. Their program failed to detect emergency vehicles. That's a huge whoopsie doopsie a model 3 tesla between those dates definitely go to get it repaired or if you have a model s between those dates you should definitely go take it in to get repaired because the last thing you want to be doing is driving and then the hood just flips up because that is just like horrible i couldn't even imagine having that happen in the tesla world why not mention that a man explodes his tesla after mechanics charge twenty three thousand for a new battery that's right he ends up exploding the tesla he states that the cost of a new Tesla Model S is about $95,000. Yeah, that's pretty cheap. But then says the experience of blowing one up is priceless because it states that the price of the battery cell to replace it is about $23,000. So let's watch a clip of the Tesla being blown up. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> He's vaporized that thing. That is awesome. <laughs> Slow motion. Look at this. Oh, that is absolutely insane. That's mind blowing. <laughs> Look at all the parts. Just absolutely vaporize that car into nothing. For an angle here. <laughs> I'm sitting here, can't even afford a Tesla, and this guy ends up blowing one up. Look at this. This is just absolutely nutters. That's just insane. Look at it. It just ends up vaporizing that car into absolutely nothing. There's a chunk of the hood. Just chunks go everywhere. That's just, that's just insane. So like I said, if you have any of those model Teslas, make sure to go take it in to get repaired because the last thing you want to do is just drive and have the hood pop up and they're like crashed. Like that would just be horrible. So anyways, please like this video, share with your friends and family, comment down below with your thoughts and opinions, and click that subscribe button down below right there. It takes a few seconds, it's free, and it helps me out a lot, and I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Stay safe. God bless you all. Take care, and peace out.